Hello guys, Rachel your Parkeologist. Today, we're gonna do the short unboxing and also reviewing the Ossipus Sigma L36 Pro White AIO Cooler. Let's do the unboxing. Inside the box, you will find a small box that contains the user's manual, the Intel and AMD brackets, the Intel backplate, screws, stand-ups, cables, and thermal paste, the display cap, and lastly, the Ossipo Sigma L36 Pro White AIO cooler. Let's go to the specifications and features. The water block has dimensions of 80 by 78 by 97 millimeters. The radiator has dimensions of 397 by 120 by 27 millimeters. The tube has a length of 400 millimeters. The Sigma L36 Pro White AIO cooler is the first AIO cooler from Ossipus with a display that was showcased during Computex 2025. The display screen is a 3.5 inch IPS screen with 640 by 480 resolution with a floating design. The display cap is not only showcasing a display but also an ARGB lighting, which makes it like a background lighting for the display. The display cap is being held by magnets for a toolless adjustment of the display when you want it in different orientations. The pump housing itself is made from plastic that has a ceramic bearing shaft and bush. The cold plate is made from copper and is larger than usual or standard sizes. It also features a toolless design in replacement of brackets. You just need to slide the brackets that you want and it will stick in place. The display can be controlled using the USB cable while the lighting can be controlled using the 3-pin male and female ARGB cable. The pump can be controlled using the 3-pin pump cable. The radiator is your typical aluminum radiator with a cross-flow fin design. It doesn't have any screw protectors so it's much better to use the provided screws for the radiator or it will get damaged. There are Ossipus logo on opposite sides of the radiator. The tube is your typical rubber tube with white sleeves. The tube is connected to the radiator through the metal fittings, while it is connected to the pump through metal and plastic fittings. But I find out it doesn't swivel that easily. The included fans looks like the Delta F12 fans, but have a much better configuration. It has rubber pads at each corner to lessen the vibration and noise. The fan has a maximum speed of 2400 rpm and a maximum airflow of 90 cfm. The fan can be controlled using the 4-pin fan cable. For the software, it will showcase the compatible device that you can control, the status of your PC, some system configurations or specifications, and the settings of the software. When you click the Sigma L36 Pro on the device tab, it will let you configure your display. You can change the orientation or angle of the display and you can choose from the different themes provided and it will show it to you almost instantly. And one of my favorites, you can make your own theme using the theme editor. Here, you can add multimedia files of your liking and add the needed data or text you want to show in your display. Let's install the AIO cooler.
Here are my final thoughts. Build quality and design-wise, it's definitely there. The color feels solid in hand, with a premium finish that reflects Ossipus' attention to detail. Its white color scheme paired with clean lines and tasteful ARGB accents gives it a striking look that will complement most builds. I've tested other products from Ossipus before, and I can confidently say the quality hasn't go down. If anything, it is consistent and still impressive. Installation is straightforward and beginner-friendly. The manual is clear, concise, and easy to follow, which makes the whole process a lot less intimidating even for the first-time builders. Temperature-wise, the Ossipo Sigma L36 Pro shows a very strong thermal performance compared to the coolers in the lineup. It consistently keeps the CPU in check, landing as one of the top coolers of the charts while maintaining stability across different workloads. This makes it a solid performer not just on paper but also in practical use, showing that it can handle demanding scenarios without breaking a sweat. This is the first product I've tested that combines IPS display with ARGB lighting as a backdrop in a single water block. It's a unique design choice and easily one of the Sigma L36 Pro's biggest selling points. The display adds a touch of customization and flair, while the lighting makes it pop even more in a showcase build. Ossipus definitely tried to push the envelope here, and it shows. That said, not everything is perfect. The IPS display is attached magnetically, which is convenient but I found the magnet to be a little on the weak side. If your case moves, the display can come loose. It's not a deal breaker, but it's something worth pointing out. Another thing to note is the fans. While they do a great job with airflow, they can get loud at full load. This might be a drawback. Overall, the Ossipo Sigma L36 Pro White is a solid entry in the AIO cooler space, blending reliable build quality with an eye-catching design. The IPS display paired with ARGB lighting is a standout feature that sets it apart from many other coolers on the market. Even if it has a couple of drawbacks, it delivers a strong balance of performance and aesthetics. You can buy the Ossipo Sigma L36 Pro White for around $138 or 8,030 pesos at your nearest Ossipus affiliated online and physical stores. I hope this video is informational for you. For more videos, click on the subscribe button and follow my Facebook page. And see you in the next video.